seventh rugby legend Waisele Serevi has uh, spoken of his uh, delight at returning to Kenya after 14 years. Serevi remembered a session with the then little known players Humphrey Kayange, Collins Injera, and uh, Biko Adema, who went on to blow up on the global stage. Serevi is in the country as a head coach of the Russian Academy for the 2019 Safari Sevens. Fijian Sevens rugby legend Awei Sele Serevi featured in four Rugby World Cup Sevens tournaments, winning in 1997 and 2005. He also led Fiji as a player coach to the 2005-2006 Sevens World Series title. Serevi was last in Kenya in 2005 when he was the chief guest for the Safari Sevens. I still remember a little bit of that time when I came and uh, there were two teams, the Kenyan national team and the Shuja. And they asked me and I said, no, no, I want to play with the Suja, the young boys. And then that time it was uh, Humphrey and all those young guys, they're still c upcoming. And uh, we had a great time with uh, all those boys in that uh, tournament. And uh, after that, the next five years, uh, they became the household name in Sevens, Kenya and uh, all over the world. And uh, it's an honor and privilege to be back here at the home of uh, Humphrey, uh, Colin and Jera, and all those uh, Biko and all those big superstars in Sevens. Serevi now leads the Russian contingent that consists of the Russian Academy and the Stava to this year's Safari Sevens. The two sides held a joint training session at the St. Mary School this morning. Russia got relegated from the World Rugby Series and they are in the hunt for a core team status. We are here to try and learn and try and get... Uh, uh, these boys to play competitive teams. Serevi also dazzled in 15s rugby and with the Rugby World Cup ongoing in Japan, he picks his highlights from the group stage and also looks ahead to which teams may play in the final. Japan uh, has uh, taken uh, 15s rugby to another level. It's difficult to choose who will win, but I believe that uh, it will be New Zealand, uh, South Africa, and uh, whoever comes out of Australia and England. So that is what uh, I believe. And even Wales. The presence of a Sevens legend Waisele Serevi in the Safari Sevens shows that the state of this tournament has gone up a note. It is now up to the new Kenya Sevens coach Paul Finney to ensure that he gets success in his first outing as a new head coach. The Shuja and Moran squads that will represent Kenya in the Safari Sevens that kicks off on Friday will be named Wednesday morning at the RFUA grounds.